Hi everyone, my name is Melissa Bender and this is my workout for the day. It is going to be a tough one, full body exercise. Um, so let's get started. The very first exercise I'm doing today is jumping jacks because I want to get my blood flowing and my body prepped. Don't forget you should always warm up before starting your exercise. So here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. The next exercise I'm doing is a V at Burpe. So I'm going to get my mat. And this one's a little bit different from how I normally do it, but not too far off. What we're going to do is we're going to lay on our backs. Stomach pulls in, arms reach, legs lift. Reach for your toes in a V up. You're going to come down. Plant, I cross my feet to come over, but you can come over however is comfortable for you. Plant both hands on the floor. Come into push up position. Push up, jump, jump up to the sky. That's one. Okay, so lay back down. Three. Make sure you keep good form the entire time. And I like to jump my feet back. Four. Seven. So these are pretty tough already. I'm halfway done. Eleven. Twelve. Fourteen. Six. Seventeen. Nineteen, one more. Twenty. Next I'm doing squat jacks, so my hands are going to come behind my head. Chest stays lifted, core pulls in tight, 
I'm going to squat down with my knees together. So squatting like I do in chair pose, butt comes down and then I'm going to jump out into a low squat, jump in into a low squat. That's one, two, three. Make sure you're getting nice and low, four. Knees stay behind your toes, five, and your butt pushes backwards toward the wall. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, Next, I'm going to do 20 mountain climbers, and it's going to be right, left is one, right, left is two. Okay, so going into my push-up position, back stays in a nice straight line, core pulls in tight, knees drive to my chest, and you can tap your foot down if you want, or you can keep it lifted, and one, two, three, try and keep your arms under your shoulders, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Next I'm doing a reaching lunge, so I'm going to start by stepping with my right leg, and then after I get through my reps, I will switch to my left leg. So I'm going to step really far forward, so when I come down into my lunge, my back leg can either stay straight, or you can even bend it and bring it close to the floor, and then I'm going to reach. I prefer the straight leg variation. So my weight comes forward into my right heel as I reach over it, and I'm going to stand all the way back up. That's one. Step and reach and push back up. That's two. Three. Four. Five. Six. And this is a variation of warrior one, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, shoulders stay relaxed, 17, don't let them bunch up near your ears, 18, 19. Okay, same thing on the left side. So I'm going to lift my arms. Like I said, shoulders stay relaxed. They shouldn't come up toward your ears. Bring them down, push your shoulder blades down your back so you can see the difference. Okay, so stepping with my left foot this time, reach and then push up through your heel to come up. That's one. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, halfway done, eleven, shoulders relax, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, 
15, 16, 17, three more, 18, 19, last one. The next exercise I'm doing is moon goddess, so I'm going to be moving from goddess pose into half moon pose. So my feet turn out into a wide base squat, um, significantly wider than my hips. So I'm going to come down, and you can keep your hands in prayer or you can keep them out to the side, into a squat, pressing your knees out toward the back wall, and I'm going to tilt to my right side first, lift my leg, and touch the floor. And then come back into my goddess, that was one, and go to the other side. You might have to move slowly to keep your balance. Up, oh, that's two. Three. Four. Ooh. Falling. Five. Six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, Last one, 20. Okay, next I'm doing three part abs. So I'm gonna lay on my back, shoulder blades lift, core pulls in, arms stretch out, but my shoulders stay relaxed again. I'm going to stretch my feet up, bring them up, open, reach through, together, hip lift. That's one. Down, up, reach, and hip lift. That's two. Hip lift, that's three, down, up, reach, together, hip lift, that's four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, control your movements, thirteen, and keep breathing. 14, 15, 16, starting to feel the burn, 17, 18, 19, 20. Okay, next I'm doing more abs. So again, my head is gonna lift. This time my fingers are gonna reach toward my toes. Whole time I'm moving, I'm gonna be moving my arms slightly up and down. So I'm going to do leg lifts. One, 
two. This is really engaging my whole core. Pull your abs in tight. Three. Four. Try and keep your low back on the ground. Five. Shoulder blades lift. Six. Seven. My core is really working. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Last one. Okay, next I'm going to do a warrior deadlift. So you can do that. I'm going to use a barbell. You can use it with body weight. You could do it with hand weights, even holding onto soup cans. Um, just decide what your level is and what you want to do. But without any weight, the form is like this. You're going to lift your right leg first, standing on your left leg. As you reach back with your leg, you can slightly bend your forward leg. If you have no weights, you can reach. If you're holding a weight, you're going to keep your back straight and hold the weight straight down and come up keeping your back straight and hinging at your hips. Okay, so with my weight, I'm gonna hold on to it. I'm not gonna be lifting it with my arms. I'm just gonna hold my arms extended and let it stretch down, slight bend, and come up. That's one. Two. Three. Four. That was kind of three and a half. <laughs> so I'll do this one. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine, ten. I'm going to switch legs now. So standing on my right leg. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, I'm going to take a little break. Okay, I'm finishing. I took about maybe 20 seconds. So I'm back to my right side. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, eight, that was nine, ten. Other side. Find my balance. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, last one, ten. Okay, next I'm doing weighted squats, so I'm holding the same amount of weight, which is 75 pounds. 
My feet are a little bit further than hip distance apart. My back stays straight. My butt reaches backwards until my thighs come parallel. And I squeeze up through my glutes and thighs. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Twelve. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. Eighteen. Nineteen. Last one. Okay, next I'm going to do a decline push-up with a knee tap. So, I'm going to use my chest for this. You can use a stability ball, you can use a sturdy chair, or you could do these from a regular push-up position, or even do a knee push-up. Um, so, what I'm going to do, it, basically it's a Spider-Man push-up on a decline. So, my hands are going to go on the floor, my toes are going to go on the top of the chest, abs pull in tight, I'm going to do a push-up. <laughs> When I come to the plank position, bring one knee to my elbow. That was one. Two. Three. Four. I tap my nose to the ground. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, last one, 20. Okay, I'm finishing up now with jump kicks, so I'm going to do right side and then left side. So I'm going to lift my right leg and kick with my left. So switch, that's one. Whoops. Switch, two, three, four, five. Don't worry about how high you kick, six, seven, just go to your level. Eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Same thing on the other side. So I'm lifting my left leg this time. Kicking with my right. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Okay guys, that's it for today's workout. Thank you so much for joining me. It was a tough one. You can see I worked really hard. I'm really sweaty. The breakdown will be on my blog as usual with about 200 free different workouts now. So I will see you next time and I hope you have a great night.